Financial planning is the task of determining how to help individuals and families achieve their goals by optimizing their financial situation through a well-developed financial plan. It is an ongoing process that works to reduce stress about money, provides for short-term needs and helps individuals and families achieve their long-term goals. So when thinking about what is financial planning? The best definition is that financial planning is an opportunity, an opportunity that lies within the foundation of making lives better. An opportunity that, for example, uh, would allow individuals and families to be more present in their lives and their relationships because of how financial planning works to resolve financial uncertainty and anxiety. So in closing, when thinking about financial planning, I'm reminded of a saying from French writer Antoine de Saint-Exupéry, who once said, a goal without a plan is just a dream. And financial planning is a plan that turns dreams into reality. Why did I choose personal financial planning? Because before I even knew about the personal financial planning major here at K-State, I had an interest in retirement planning, investing, um, planning for the future. And I wanted basic skills such as how to buy a house, um, how to buy a car, and other things like that everybody will need to do in their lifetime. Um, I also really enjoy helping people. And I wanted to choose a career path that would give me the opportunity to help people for the rest of my life. In my time here at K-State, I have been given the skills and knowledge necessary to help plan for retirement, insurance, estate planning, um, investing, and I'll be able to, to use these skills after graduation. After graduation, with these skills, I'll be able to help people every day with their personal finances, planning for their future, um, giving them the proper insurance they might need, or um, helping them invest their money. Um, so why did I choose personal financial planning? Because it gives me the opportunity to combine both my interests and my desire to help people on an everyday basis. And a heart for people. Someone who understands and is good with numbers, but also loves working with people to help them reach their goals. Actually, Kansas State Financial Planning is one of the top ranked programs in the country, and that really is the benefit of coming and spending your time uh, with us at Kansas State, because no matter where you live, no matter what type of job that you might want in this space, a degree from Kansas State and from financial planning is really going to matter. You know, it starts with a uh, nationally ranked faculty member. We're very lucky to have the folks that we do. Uh, that, that a lot of active planners are looking at to understand how they should best practice uh, their business. Um, but what really makes us stand out is the way that we care for our students. Uh, we're involved in their lives. We're making sure they're learning about different career paths uh, and that they are finding the right path for them um, that'll maximize whatever it is that they want to accomplish in life. So. I would say uh, that yes, we are highly ranked, but the best part about it is uh, we still are true to our Midwest values and keeping our heads down and doing what's right to serve our students. You can major in personal financial planning at K-State. You can complete the degree either online or on campus. You can also do the financial counseling minor, the personal financial planning minor, and the Kansas insurance certificate. So the CFP designation or the Certified Financial Planner designation is really a big deal. And I'd say uh, that the opportunity that a student would have in this program at the undergraduate level to complete and meet the requirements for the exam are outstanding. You know, we have over 100 students right now that are in our master's program that are coming back to campus to fulfill the educational requirements for the CFP that they weren't able to do uh, while they were receiving their bachelor's. When you think about the CFP, there's really four requirements that you have to make. Uh, one is the education, which you'll receive through Kansas State. But I'd also say we do a lot more than the basic requirements for the CFP. We work really hard to help students understand the technical 
and the, the social communication aspects that they're going to need to thrive as a financial planner. In addition to education, uh, they also have to pass a, an exam uh, that is a certified financial planner exam. Uh, this is something that once you graduate, uh, you'll get to study for. Usually it's about 150 hours um, and you would take that. Uh, third, you would need uh, experience, uh, depending on who you work for. That's somewhere between two to three years of work experience before you can use the designation. And the last component is the ethics component. And certified financial planners are held to a higher standard um, than other financial advisors that are out on the marketplace. And that is that they're always going to act as fiduciaries for their clients. They're always going to put the client's interest uh, first. All those together mean that if you get a degree from Kansas State, you're positioned to really be at the forefront um, and you're gonna have incredibly high demand uh, for the skill sets that you're gonna be able to bring. If I had to pick my favorite class that I've taken so far in personal financial planning, I would have to say advanced personal financial planning, PFB 305 has been my favorite. It was really nice early on in the major to look at what it took to make a comprehensive financial plan before we even got into the weeds in different topical classes such as investments, insurance, or retirement. Um, being able to see the different components and the different puzzle pieces and how they fit together before you worried about in-depth situations really, I think, benefited me as I went through internships and other um, experiences I had while in the major. There's a lot of different ways where you can get involved and be a part of the PFP program. Uh, starting my freshman year, I was in Financial Planning Association where I got to hear different professionals speak about their experience in the field. And then I also started getting involved in PowerCap Financial. There's two sides of it. So there's student advisory board where you help put on events and market for PowerCap Financial. And then there's peer counseling, which I will start next year, uh, where you get to interact with students and your peers and give them financial planning advice. So it's a great firsthand experience. Another opportunity is the peer mentorship program. I have loved being a peer mentor. Uh, you can opt in to have an upperclassman help you navigate college and the PFP program, how to study and just little tips and tricks. And then lastly, there's also peer tutoring. So you can reach out to any of the tutors for every single class that PFP has to offer and get the assistance that you may need if you're struggling. Um, altogether, there's a lot of different ways for you to get involved and you can just keep getting more involved as your time goes on at K-State. It's one of the things that I love the most about PFP. Yes, we do have scholarships. We have scholarships for students who are majoring in personal financial planning, or even students who are minoring in financial counseling, minoring in personal financial planning, or pursuing the certificate in Kansas insurance. They range from $1,000 one time to renewable ones that are $5,000 a year. Yes, you can do this bachelor's degree entirely online. In fact, you can do any of our undergraduate or graduate classes, certificates, or degrees online. Um, college is a lot of fun. There's a lot to do, and it's uh, it's kind of a juggling act to balance everything. Something that I found that really helped me get through college was uh, just having a calendar and using the calendar in Canvas. It's a great tool. Um, just having everything written down so you can see day by day what you need to get done. That way, you know exactly what your day is going to be, your week's going to be, the next month's going to be and you can plan all the fun stuff around the stuff you need to get done for school. Luckily, our teachers are great, and they try not to throw a whole bunch of stuff at you all at the same time. They all work together for that, so use a calendar, and you should be good to go. My favorite PFP memory is traveling to conferences um, all across the nation with some of my closest friends in the major. Um, I loved getting to experience these new places while learning valuable industry knowledge and then also having the opportunity to go explore um, the area that we were in with um, all my classmates. 
The first thing I would tell an incoming student is to make sure to get to know both your instructors and the faculty within the department. Um, we have nationally ranked faculty, so if you get to know them well, they have your best interests at heart, will help you through your academics, but will also um, help you make connections. So we can basically pinpoint anywhere we want to go, um, internship or job-wise, and we can find a way to get you there based on those um, national connections that our faculty have. Um, in addition, my second tip would be stay organized. Make sure that you're writing down all your assignments, due dates, any exams coming up, and make sure that you are well prepared for those. And lastly, um, a big emphasis on this one, but always get involved as much as you can um, as time allows within your schedule. Um, this is super important both to make connections with the faculty and your fellow students, which will um, provide you more connections within your career um, and create lifelong friendships, but also it looks great on a resume and will put you apart from others that might may be applying to the same job or internship as you. And then just lastly, overall, college is supposed to be a really fun time. Um, the four years go super fast. Um, just make sure that you make the most of your time here, um, both academically and um, extracurricular.